so there's been quite a few people a lot of questions in the comments and people messaging me and students in the class where their images are not tracking now almost every image I've used has tracked I know that's easy to say the well it works for me you know we saw that it tracked my Mars and my Earth straight away um, so all I can comment on is common mistakes that I've seen while fixing students kind of in my class the Earth, the third rod. Um, which is sometimes the source image itself so one one is let's say that is the original Mars image I'm using that's fine but I've seen some of my students they've literally stretched the source image we can see now that it's, it's quite pixely it's been stretched horizontally and I've seen quite a few have actually done this in their source images so when they come back into unity their image that they are tracking uh, where's my tracked images? So they've got their Mars image sort of like that, but then the one they've actually using, so the image is one of the texture, the one they're tracking is not necessarily the same thing. The other thing I've sometimes seen, and I'm not, I'm, I've not tested this, but I do know if an image is too simple, it seems to struggle with tracking. So if it's not tracking image, play about with your source image first. Is it the right resolution? Is it not too high, not too small? It's the Goldilocks image. Have you stretched it? In which case, maybe just fix it, just resave it. It might just start working. Quite often with my students, I've gone round, fixed, just re edited the texture and it suddenly starts working. The other thing I've noticed is when you go into the XR environment, so I'm currently, so if I go into the edit mode of this environment, there we go, we can see these things. What I've noticed with some people um, is their image is just too far away. They, for example, they might have put it right back here, they might have put it right up in this far corner, and I've just noticed that sometimes if they are too far away from the camera, they can't be tracked. I'm just going to undo that. So if I was to go back to the original default um, setting, so back in the original default one where most people start with the simulation, is they've got into edit mode of this, so I'm going to duplicate it. Uh, yeah, that'll do into edit mode and then they've literally moved the tracking image sort of up and over here also notice the other common mistake I know covered in the other in the other video is separating the tracked image from their empty so the one thing I've recommended people do is if they're creating a tracked image is just to go straight in with the quad in the last one I did an empty um, and then they can sort of put their tracked image on there so images tracked image I just drag Mars on and then like I said some people are separating those out a little bit so is that simulated tracked image and then of course making sure the image is on there and then like I said some people are just moving it too far away or the wrong scale so if it's not working for you try just bringing it in bring it a bit closer and then scale it down a little bit so don't just make it fix it's too big so moving it further away let's just scale it down a little bit and the other thing if I remember correctly was scaling that to one point well to point one okay so basically that's how you can add a video and that is the really common thing is play about with these I had a student where all they had to do was move their image from here to there to there and then suddenly it started tracking and that was it okay so I hope that's been helpful to some of you if it has please remember to like subscribe positive comment below and I'll see you in the next video